Hi, my name is John Osipinski. I'm the author of An Undetected Acid Alkaline Imbalance. The subtitle of my book says, Warning, Acid Waste and Trapped Proteins Are Damaging Your Lymphatic System, Creating Illness and Disease. In 2003, I learned of acid alkaline balance from jo Dr. John Disgray, a naturopathic medicine doctor. And he actually was very active in the 70s and said at that time, there was a lot of research going on sh on food and showing that if you ate certain foods, that your pH change in your body and a lot of your health problems left. Well, after learning from Dr. Disgray, I checked my pH and me and my family were a hundred times more acidic than we're supposed to be, which now explains many of our little health problems. Well, I decided to research this especially acid alkaline balance and I went to our Merck manual which is our physician's desk reference what they learned from and I learned some about acid alkaline balance but they see it more of testing with blood when we really need to test saliva and urine to get a better idea of how acidic our tissues are but I realized that the lymphatic system is really ignored in medicine the Merck manual is three to four thousand pages and it basically mentioned the lymph system four or five times. The lymph system is connected to every system in the body. It's connected to every health problem we have. It's a contributing factor that it's not functioning, not cleaning your organs or your brain or your uh, eyes. Everything has to do with the lymphatic system and whether you're acid or alkaline. I started writing letters to my local mayor, my governor. At that time, it was uh, Governor Napolitano. And I got a runaround. No one wanted to talk to me. I even went to their offices, but you know, it didn't work out very well. I then went to wrote my congressman and had to go to his office, but I wasn't treated very well there. I was treated like a like I was a terrorist. They were afraid of me. But I was trying to explain how there is misinformation that is hurting the nation and probably the world. Well, there's no doubting there's a problem. Even though I wrote hundreds of letters uh, over the last nine years. I really got very little response. People don't want to touch this, that there is information missing from our medical system that is affecting every one of us. Well, I decided to contact the Surgeon General's office and I dealt with a senior advisor there for f five months talking to him a few times. And I, he asked me, how do you get rid of this acid imbalance? I said, through education, we need to educate the public. And he basically told me there was nothing he could do to help me. I sent many other letters to politicians, to leading doctors, and I got very few responses. I did get one letter from a leading doctor who told me never mention autism and Alzheimer's in the same letter, because you'll not be taken serious. How can we get over that? We have to begin looking at new science that shows that 48% of our brain fluid must flow to our lymphatic system. So that explains how many of our brain problems from depression, anxiety, bipolar, Alzheimer's, autism is really due to a backup of waste in our body. Well, after writing many uh, letters and not getting a response in 2009, I decided to write Secretary Sebelius in charge of our nation's health care. I sent her uh, about an inch worth of uh, literature, research, pictures of the lymphatic system, my book and a four page letter explaining how the nation is being hurt by misinformation about the lymphatic system. A few weeks later I received a letter back from the National Institutes of Health saying that they agree with me that the lymphatic system needs to be understood especially the biology of the lymphatic system and they realized this NIH in the year 2000 so they funded some research and I commend them for that. But it will take 30 years for my information to get into the medical system the way everything works. So if you would like to, again, be ahead of the medical curve, learn information that can dramatically change your life. And remember, even Dr. Oz says that the lymphatic system is ignored in medicine. So I'll tell you, if you stop ignoring your lymphatic system, you will see a dramatic change in your life. And it's not about being perfect, because I'm not a vegan and I'm not a vegetarian. I know I should be, but I want to live life. I'm like 85% of the other people. So learn how to balance your life and learn how to balance your pH and your lymphatic system starts to flow again. 
starts to work to clean waste out of your body and many of your problems will actually leave. So if you have any questions about this, please contact me at lymphman.com. And if you feel this information is warranted, please like me at Lymphman at Facebook. I would really appreciate that. So please, any questions, contact me. I'll help you understand how this information can change your and your family's health.